So what's going on guys, this is P. Sharma and in this tutorial I'm going to tell you what is an IDE and which OS is going to support which IDE, which, which is the best for your OS and all. Uh, an IDE is nothing, an IDE is an integrated development environment. Uh, as, as the name suggests, it is a digital environment used to develop games, software, hardware, about anything with code. All that offers integration or control over many aspects of development from debugging which means adding or removing uh, or changing codes that prevent your programming from running as intended all the way you mm -hmm. all the way here to compiling which roughly means taking your code and turning into something that a computer can understand and if uh, you want to become a programmer then you must have uh, Later on, in the beginning, you have to install an ID, start working with an ID. An ID is uh, it's nothing as like just text editor, simple text editor you, you are using, uh, but with a better interface and it provides of uh, it, it will provide you hints and the error in your code wherever you make. Um, Mm. That's all about an ID, but and whether you want to uh, an ID is an important part of your programming, and if you want to code uh, game software or anything, you can just go through an ID and start coding and. You will name it, and ID is the best is your best friend to ensuring your success. I personally recommend your for this four uh, IDs: Atom, Bracket, Video Studio, and Sublime Test. And these IDs, uh, an Atom is for is de developed by an GitHub, and you can download it for an iOS as well as for Windows also. I personally recommend you to work with uh, the video studio. Uh, I like it. I personally like it. I have a very lightweight it and uh, due to fancy look and all this stuff. I just like it. So you can just go over the website on code.vstudio.com and just download it for your Windows or iOS. OS, uh, Apple devices. After the downloading this, you just have to go and install it. I have already downloaded it, so I'm not going to download and install it. After the installation of the ID, you can just go and open your ID. After opening, launching your ID, just go find the extension bar and search for two extensions. First is Beautify. Oh, sorry. Beautify. Ah, this is, I have already installed it. Beautify is nothing. It just makes your code look fancy, beautifully. I mean, with different colors, you are going to see your codes. And also, you and next, you have to search for the live server, which help you to directly uh, host your file on the web browser by directly from the Visual Studio software only so hope you guys like this tutorial and if you if do so come uh, tell me what are the error and all in this video what I need to improve so thanks guys thanks for watching take care stay safe bye bye